welcome back my dear students how are you so let us start the new poem of our english okay so everybody take out this book focus open page number 74 and the name of the poem is who taught the birds okay so today we are going to start this poem i request all of you write down date and great task on the top hope you all have written the date and the great task so let us read everybody has to keep the pencil on the word Who taught the bird to build their nest of softest wool and hay and moss? Who taught her how to weave it best and lay down lay the tiny wicks across? So, what is the poem about? Poem is about that who taught taught the bird that bird you know you must have seen the birds they are making their nest so nicely so beautifully with the they are using twigs, wool, hay hay is kind of uh, dry grass and moss is kind of like uh, green soft green grass okay so how they are using these things to make their nest who taught the bird to build her nest who is telling who is teaching them to build their nest of softest wool they are using softest wool soft wool hay dry dry grass moss green uh, grass who taught her how to weave it best who is teaching them that how to weave that nest so nicely and lay the tiny twigs across and around the uh, nest they are laying down their tiny tiny twigs to see here as you can see in the picture it's there same way okay and lay the tiny twigs across who is teaching them how to lay the tiny twigs twigs means dry sticks very small small thin dry sticks so who is teaching them that they have to keep the dry sticks around and they are sitting over there you must have seen the nest okay so as you can see here how birds are making so beautifully their nest how they are making their nest so nicely and so beautifully they are using everything to make their nest which can make their nest soft yes who taught the busy bee to fly who is teaching the bee busy bee to fly how they are using how they are flying how who is teaching them among the spe sweetest herbs and flowers herbs are small plants i told you and flowers how they are flying among the sweetest herbs and the flowers and lay her store of honey by providing food for winters are and what they are doing for winters they are laying their honey they are providing us we are using honey in the winters so these bees are giving us honey okay so how they are making the store they are having the store of honey so much honey they are having with them and with which we use in the winter season okay to save us from cold and cough and all so they are providing food for winter hours they are providing us honey for winter hours when winters is there who taught the little ant the way her narrow cell so well to pour who is teaching them the small ant how they are making narrow cell narrow cell, cell is small room very small room to bore who is teaching them how to bore the room you must have seen in the mud they are making their house they they are boring their house and through the pleasant summer day to gather up her winter store and they are where they are making they are making their house in pleasant summer day and winter comes they are gathering up their things and in winters they are not coming out from the ground they are storing their food and everything which they require in the in their house in their small narrow room small narrow cell okay which they are using when winter comes okay so who taught the little and the ways so here we are learning how the bird bee and ant learning how to make the house how to make their beautiful room how they can use that your room how they can save their food for winters okay so so who taught the bird the answer is goat goat is teaching them how to make the nest we are not going to teach them goat is teaching them how to make the nest with the soft wool they are using hay they are using moss the human being are not going to teach them goat is teaching them they are learning them busy bee is giving us bee honey honey they are using they are roaming they are flying around the flowers around the small plants they are giving us uh, honey for the winter season same way little ant they are also making their house in small 
narrow cell a very small house thin very small narrow narrow means very narrow means very small okay which is not broad so they are used they are making their house in the mud yes and through the pleasant summer day full pleasant summer day they are living in their house and to gather up her winter store why they are making their house for to win, save her food for winter season okay so this poem is written by jane taylor j a n e jane t a y l o r taylor so the name of the poem is who told the birds so you all have to read it so take care god bless you all